It is not news unknown that the poster of Indian filmmaker Lena Manimekalai's documentary Kali became a hot topic of discussion after it portrayed goddess Kali holding a pride flag and smoking a cigarette. A section of the society jumped up against Lena for allegedly hurting their religious sentiments. The complaints went to such an extent that there was a social movement of sorts calling for the director's arrest. Hashtag arrest Lena Manimekalai was trending all over social media and an FIR was filed against the director. Though Manimekalai clarified saying that the documentary revolves around the events that take place one evening when Gordon Scully appears and strolls on the streets of Toronto, the society maintained its ground. The poster was released more than 10 days ago, but it is still one of the most discussed topics. Some are calling it a promotional stunt, while the rest are just flustered with how the Hindu goddess has been depicted. But this is not the first time a movie or a filmmaker has been accused of hurting religious sentiments. Let's do a quick roundabout of some films that fall under this category. PK When Amir Khan's PK released, there was a lot of tension in the air. Most people felt the movie was making fun of Indian gods. Moviegoers have called out a scene where an actor cosplaying as Lord Shiva was being mocked. They did not take this well, said it hurt their religious sentiments. Theatres were vandalised, there were calls to stop some screenings and the government had to offer police protection in cinema halls. Lakshmi Yet another movie starring Akshay Kumar which managed to anger people. The horror comedy was initially titled Lakshmi Bomb, but many Hindu groups took offence for associating a derogatory word like bomb with the name of a Hindu goddess. A legal notice was sent to the filmmakers to change the name. After the turmoil, the makers changed the name to Lakshmi. Tandam In this web series, the makers were accused of ridiculing Hindu gods and passing comments on them. They were also accused of provoking communal tensions through their dialogues. An FIR was filed against the actors and producers, urging the police to take strict action against the Tandav team. The OTT platform's India head was pulled up to the police station and the team had to give an explanation to the INB ministry. Eventually, the scenes which were allegedly hurting sentiments were removed. The Supreme Court also denied protection to the makers, said they need to take up the issue at related high courts where the complaints have been filed. A suitable boy The All India Shia Personal Law Board sent a legal notice to the OTT platform and producers of the web series for intentionally hurting the religious sentiments of the Shia community. The makers had to issue a public apology for this. There were also complaints about a scene where a Muslim man and a Hindu woman were seen kissing at a temple. They said this show is promoting love jihad. Two senior officials were booked by the police for objectionable scenes. Hashtag boycott Netflix was also trending for some time. If you like this video, then like, share and subscribe to Mirror Now.